Hey, but we talking about this these gas prices because man, inflation. Inflation, inflation man, going it's crazy, man. Bread going up again. Man, a bag of a bag of chips. I'm talking about the personal bag. Yeah. Not the big bag. It's personal bag gonna bring you two dollars, man. Man, it's imperative. Two twenty nine, man. It's imperative. You learn how to make some tuna. <laughs> just made the tuna. It's imperative, bucket. That's gonna save you a lot of money. With the, this, what you do, man? When you try to make some some good tuna, Tell man. Em. Man, you put your you chop up beyond because you need something crunchy in there, uh-huh. right? Yeah. What you put in there to make it crunch? You got I, I to have some, some onion. Crunch. Yeah, put, put some, some onions, onions in there. Dice up beyond is real small, right? Yeah, just a little crunch. And you put your seasonings in there, right? Then this this is the game changer, Brad. Put me on too, man. Throw some honey in that thing. <laughs> Man, I, I would like to thing, get man. feedback from the uplift. For what's our squad, man? Man, the ULF squad. Man, I like to get some feedback. Put some honey in I'd the like tuna, man. I like to get man. some feedback of what is the best broke food out there, man. It like, gotta be top ramen up there. Yeah, but it's high sodium. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but if but, you're struggling, so like this is my excuse when I tell mom because I tell cent, her, I'm, I'm telling her that I, I be eating the ramen right. She's like that salty thing, right? Ooh, you know my mom's ooh, a nurse. Yeah. Your mama, yeah, mama. So I'm telling, she's like you can't be eating that salty. I'm like my, all the salt is in the water. I ain't drinking. You ain't got to drink. I all ain't the drinking all the water. Yeah, that be th- I thought about right. that too. Yeah, the broth. Yeah, the broth, all the, all the salt, man. and I ain't drinking. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, yeah, so, you dump that out. Yeah, or <laughs> or the noodles soaked it all out. Hey, when I was I don't in, know when I was in college, man. This is how you know ramen is the top struggle food. One, everybody got ramen. And yeah. You get you a thirty pack for two dollars. <sighs> so I had this this top ramen, man, from Walmart. And it's in the hood, so mm-hmm. they got all flaming hot flavored stuff, mm-hmm. flaming hot chips, yeah. spicy ramen noodles with yeah. the, everything spicy, right? Yeah. I dump the water in there, make the ramen. Then I'm looking at the water. I'm like, and that ramen was good. What if I dump the water from this ramen into the next ramen? Bro, I'm, hey, I'm concentrating the ramen. My juice. man's saving what? Man, this is this is imperative. Now I was gonna have. He was battling inflation. <laughs> <laughs> this is how be you beat inflation. Man. You gonna run your water bill up using water? This one is how time? you beat inflation. You got to use your, reuse your water, man. This is what we trying to put you on to, man. Yeah, so you got to go to the grocery store. You know what I'm saying? Well, you give them some ways to be inflation. You can even go to the grocery store, cook your own food, right? Because remember, yeah. when, when I was down bad, man, food food was killing my pockets. Top dog. Food was killing my pockets. Got to make Top your own dope. food. Can't be going out every other weekend and, and buying, uh, you know, getting your 10-piece chicken nuggets hey, meal. Man, you know what? <laughs> you know what's Messing crazy? with Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A good, man. You can't keep going, though. You know what's crazy, man? You know what I had for dinner last night? What you had? I had a 10-piece chicken McNugget. Now you gotta differentiate between the chicken nugget mm-hmm. and the chicken McNugget. Yeah, cause you know McDonald's chicken ain't real chicken. I don't care what they say, that ain't no real chicken. It's something though. Is it got chicken product? <laughs> it ain't in killing it. people. Yeah. Or maybe it is. Maybe it's they just might be killing. Stressing they out. are killing people. What you talking about, man? They been killing people. You ain't seen Super Size Me. He oh, did yeah. ate only McDonald's for one week yeah. and gained thirty pounds. That's that's on him though, man. He he already know Whoa. what it is. Like eating Twinkies. <laughs> hey, McDonald's, man. I haven't been to McDonald's in years, but I had it last night because ain't no food in the house. Yeah. That's why you got to keep your fridge stocked with food. Get you That's, a whole, what they call it? Um, Like going to Sam's Club, Costco. What they call that? Wholesale. Yeah. Wholesale yeah, membership wholesale. card. Boat. Yeah. Whatever they call it. Get you a Costco. Or the BJ's. Sam's Club, yeah. BJ's. One of them. Yeah. Buy your food in bulk, man. Stop going out. Stop going there. I know it's good. It is good. I mean, you can go out. You just got to, you know what I'm saying? You got to plan. Yeah, you got to plan it out, Put man. The, that's how that's how you're going to battle inflation, man. Because these gas prices, remember now, too, you going out, you got to pick gas in the car. Man. That's true, because then you, now you nickel and dime. Yeah. You, you in the city now, <laughs> not a gas 450. When the gas back around the way, 380. Man, so you spend gas. an 70 cents on gas. To put the people on to what you doing about going out, you know what I'm saying? Minimizing oh, right that. now, man, we just doing, we doing... Um, two weekends a two weekends a month right now. Yeah, that's how we rocking it, man. And it's free game, right? So we can go out. We ain't thinking about nothing. We having all the drinks, right? The you know the appetizers. No second right? thought. No about second it. thought. Dessert, okay. whatever, right? But it's just twice a month. Yeah, twice a month. And for the rest of we like right now we stocked up. Went to um BJ's. Uh huh. Just you know, hey man, went and got everything out of the way. Meal prepping. 
Yeah, man. So when you told me that, I said, <clears throat> that's perfect. Yeah. I'm implementing that <laughs> at the crib. Because we had just came off of the trip. Yeah. We came back, touched down. And I looked at, I ain't look, well, I was on the trip, I ain't looking at nothing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to be that guy mm -hmm. on the trip. Babe, we spending a little bit too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I said we going to go, we going to go. Yeah, because we going out, yeah, you want to have a good time. Yeah, exactly. But I'm back in my mind, I'm thinking, boy, that's probably, I'm estimating like, that's yeah, yeah. 200 right there, carry the three. Oh, my <laughs> God. So I get back, I look at the bank records, I'm like, yeah, I done ran it up. I done ran it up this yeah. too much. Next month, we ain't going to be able to do this. Mm -hmm. So we did the whole rest of February. Now, bear in mind, we did that trip first week of February. Right. Whole rest of the month, we ain't, couldn't go out. Mm -hmm. So we went to Costco, bro. I ended up dropping a bag, bag at Costco. Bag at Costco, bro. man. It's just... I, bro, I never spent this much money on groceries, bro. Yeah. So there ain't nothing in the cart. Just ketchup, paper plates. It's everything. <laughs> Twenty dollars at Costco, man. I ain't getting nothing. We, hey, we at the front of the store calculating, trying to estimate. Hey, how much you think this is? Yeah. And then I look at it, right? I'm like, well, we don't really need shrimp. We don't. <laughs> we don't need two blueberries. We could put that. I'm putting stuff in the Costco refrigerator. Yeah, yeah. In the front, you know how they sell refrigerators. Yeah. Man, I'm trying to put shit in the. <laughs> hey, bro. But buy your food in bulk. You know what I'm saying. Eat at the crib. Yeah. If you got a budget for going out, go out. Don't think about it too much. Mm -hmm. But you know, make sure you're able to to save some money at the end of the month. Yeah, That's save some goal. bread. Throw some in the stock market, and if you can, try to buy some property. Top ways to be top, top dog, man. That's how. That's Say how. That that's again, how we going. Man. That's the three three steps, man. Say three it steps. Again. Three steps, man. So food, right? Try to cook your own food. Get get bulked up on some food, right? Go to go to a um, place that sells. Um, what is it, wholesale, right? Yeah. Try to get you some property. Um, oh, man, and, and throw some extra dough into the stock market, man, and, and save your bread, man. Yeah, so, um, hey, remember, man, first things first, get your, first off, look at your finances. We yeah. talk about that all the time, but, like, don't avoid it. That's one of the most important yeah. things. You got to look at your, yeah. what you spend. Man, hey, on. you should avoid finances. Man, like, just yes, scared to look at your own bro. checking account. <laughs> knowing, knowing full well, I only have, I might not have $30. Yeah. Hey, for, for those who out there, for our younger <laughs> audience, right, you know, who just coming up, just getting their first job, stuff like that, man. Hey, just set it up automatic where you got it automatically yeah. saving money for yourself. So you're not even looking at it and thinking about it. Because when you got to keep doing... How long was he doing the check and the savings thing? Like, all right, I'm gonna do I'm gonna take some money out of my check and piss <laughs> the, on the, the, bro, check, that was, the check and saving shuffle. Yeah, the check, bro. That was not working. <laughs> back and forth. I did that for like four, four years. I probably did it for about three, four and years. And only had saved like two bands. I had about five hundred dollars. I have well 2000, for the first first three years I had about two hundred dollars. That last year I finally put focusing. away like a yeah, stack. Of two. I had that's what I had when I went back to school. Yeah, I was trying to save up for a car. Well, yeah. when I first went to school, I was saving up for a car. I had saved sixteen hundred, and then my muffler fell off. Yeah. So, time to buy a new car, right? Yeah. I buy a new car, but then the second time when I really tapped in my finances, I thought, you know, I could save a good two bands, and then I could quit my job, mm -hmm. go back to school. <laughs> but that money was gone in about two months, bro. <laughs> End of the semester, I'm dead broke, and it's all because I wasn't looking at my oh, not, yeah, finances. Not paying attention to it. You know what I'm saying? So look at your finances. A uh, good tip from another podcaster, JT, uh, Pocket Watching with JT. Mm -hmm. He said, set up your direct deposit into your savings account. Most mm -hmm. people have it set up to their checking, checking. Yeah. and then they transfer money to their saving. So if you flip it, if, especially if you're not the type of person to, to be diligent with your savings, you mm -hmm. flip it. Send the money to your savings and then pay yourself from your savings account. The same amount every single pay period or every single month, whatever you want to go with. Got you. Um, but yeah, after that, once you get that e-fund, you start investing. Once you start investing, you know, save up for a house, maybe buy your house, whatever mm -hmm. you want to do, mm -hmm. but just be conscious and, and don't avoid the finances, man. Yeah, man. Cause when they say, when they say when stuff, you know, when things is changing and you want to have that extra money to put in, that or back, to buy that things, back up cash. Yeah. You, you, you want to have that capital there, man, when stuff hit the fan. So hey, what bro, we had up next? Hey man. man, my lady, man, she woke up. But she wasn't up. She was. She would have up. Yeah. She said, "You say you want cash?" I said, "What?" <laughs> she said, "You say you want backup cash?" I said, "What you talking about?" <laughs> she said, "Huh?" <laughs> <laughs> hey. 
So we've been saying backup cash <laughs> back this whole cash. time. Backup <laughs> cash. Then when this stuff hey. started popping off overseas, she was like, I told you about we the backup, some backup <laughs> cash. I'm about to go get that's some a scary, cash. That's a scary thing, man. It's very scary, man. That's a scary thing. It's very scary, man. Hey, prayers and thoughts, man. Thoughts and prayers to the people who's being affected um, over there in the Ukraine. But check this out, man. Gas price is crazy. Gas price is crazy, man. But you know what's low? What? The stock market, man. Yeah.